right there actually warm uh first and foremost i want to give out all praise glory and honor unto yahweh bahashem yahweh shai bahashem raka and i would like to give out double honors unto the apostles and the elders at great millstone and uh, much blessing to you brothers out there laboring in truth and in sincerity okay um this lesson is gonna be on uh, uh the science of heaven okay because as of today uh jupiter and saturn are lining up in a certain way that only happens every few hundred years man okay they're gonna be a lot more closer to the planet okay and um uh 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 those that can are able to actually see the two planets together man okay and that is a rare occurrence man okay and um all these different things they're calling it the christmas star because what they are saying is this is uh this is what uh this is this the very same uh, occurrence that happened when our lord was born yahweh shine okay and uh basically what they're saying is uh 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 they are the three wise men what they're saying is that the three wise men this is what led them to the location of our lord men okay of which uh what led uh the uh what led uh the wise men to the location of our lord was uh a chariot okay because a star you cannot pinpoint a star cannot pin pinpoint at a particular uh address man regardless of how 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 much you follow it okay it was an actual uh, chariot that led the, uh, and it was not three wise men it was a company of wise men okay and what directed them to where the lord was was an actual chariot man not an actual star man okay not like the stars in the heavens okay but going back to the point is that uh this uh, uh this is a rare occurrence that's happening at this moment man okay because at this moment right now we coming up to uh to uh uh, uh to so-called christmas okay and um here in the uk we've just went uh, they've just gone into an emergency lockdown because they're saying there's a new strain of uh of the coronavirus man and then basically now all the all the liberties and the privileges that they were allowing people to have uh during the christmas day the five day um uh, uh, uh freedom that we're gonna have to meet up under one household and celebrate this particular holiday they've taken all that away okay uh, uh, other countries have uh, pretty much uh, uh cancelled all flights outside uh, out of the uk uh because of this or this new strain of the coronavirus okay and now i've just seen that even mail even uh the royal mail are not posting any packages or any parcels uh from the uk to different country uh, to different countries men are uh, in fear of them spreading uh this particular virus I mean this new strain of this new uh type of uh type of uh, uh c19 uh, virus men okay so you know already men with these signs in the heavens ESO is about to do something man okay from we've seen it through at the, the from the beginning of the year when all these things was announced that this is a a, a crisis that they are gonna move uh, forward with okay so now uh, now by the way uh, 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 I seen a video not long ago where a particular nurse was uh, was given uh, the C19 uh, uh, vaccine and then uh, straight away she fainted uh, live on tv and then uh, now i've got uh, I, somebody sent me another another video saying uh, she actually died man like 10 hours later okay so whatever the hell is in those uh, particular vaccines when you know those things not belong in your body man there's a bigger agenda to why they want to uh, force these things on people okay but then going to the point now is here like all these different uh occurrences these rare occurrences that happen in the heavenly bodies all those things are for science man okay something major is about to happen okay there's gonna be a shift or uh, there's gonna be uh, there's gonna be a uh, 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 major events that are gonna take place in the earth man okay already this uh this year of prophecy man this c19 and everything that is changed that's a that's that's a that's a major event man okay because people are not living life as normal anymore 
okay you who whoever thought at the beginning of the year that your christmas was going to be cancelled nobody did man okay but it has now okay let's read a little bit about this article and then we're gonna go to some precepts and it says uh look up at the night sky this uh this christmas and you might see a sight not too different from one from from one of the most famous festival a uh, festive story of all speaking about the time that our lord was born okay and he said that's because for the first time in hundreds of years so that's this is a rare occurrence okay it's not something that you see every day okay it says planets in our solar system are due to align in a way that would generate a bright light similar to that which uh, to that which is said to have led the three wise men of which there was no free was a company of wise men okay to the nativity uh, to the nativity scene according to us according to an astronomer okay of which that star that led that that led the way was an actual chariot man okay it says the two biggest planets in our in our celestial neighborhood uh saturn and jupiter will come the closest they have done in hundreds of years creating what the, what the researcher described as a spectacular spectacular event in the sky okay it says on monday december 21st man which also happens to be the winter uh, solstice okay so this thing that happening in the sky uh when you see things like eclipse eclipses and uh uh, this particular uh, heavenly bodies are, are, are aligning in, in rare occurrences and so on and so forth all those things are signs and tokens that something major is about to take place okay this is what the Lord created them for okay so we'll start off with the precepts going back uh, uh, to Genesis 1 and 14 and it says and I uh, says and the most I said let me say let me read the right way says and the power said let there be light in the firmament of heaven to divide the day from the night okay the firmament meaning the outer space okay it says let there be light in the firmament of heaven to divide the day is to divide the day from the night and it says and let them be for signs and for seasons and for days and for years okay so let them be for signs let's look at that word uh signs okay um, okay <clears throat> so let's go to uh the word signs and the definition for them it says uh, a sign a signal it says a distinguishing mark a banner okay a remembrance it says a, mir a miraculous sign okay it says an omen a warning a token enzyme standard miracle proof man okay what's an omen an omen is when is something let me actually put that on google omen okay it says an omen an event regarded as a portent of good or evil okay an event regarded as a portent of good and evil so when you see uh when you see when you see these rare occurrences happening in the heavenly bodies those are all events uh uh if of events uh, signaling signaling for something a major about to happen okay this is why they've got where they go uh definition there as a warning okay and we know right now we're in the we are uh, <clears throat> we are approaching a time now that brothers we, that we from the apostles all the way on down that we've been speaking about as a uh 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 what what's the number one prophecy first of all the mark of the uh, the mark of the beast which is that microchip okay jacob's trouble okay and already at this moment now these things is no longer something that we be speaking now these are something is something that is being played out now okay the what they are uh, the c9 c19 uh maxine uh uh being uh uh 
are being given to people at the moment okay and then who knows what's the next step now man okay they've just we just had the, uh, a, a new strain of the c19 virus that's uh, infecting people in the uk okay so uh, right now going into 2021 there's about this is all a, a, an omen a warning a token okay an enzyme of major things about to be played out here on the planet earth okay a major shift man it's been nine months and people have been waiting for uh, for life to go back to normal and what's happening now it seems like it's getting worse now okay because now we're in the time now where the where the visions are actually speaking now okay that mirth from the people man now is being taken away now okay so this is where we are now man and all these things when these heavenly bodies now they're aligning up in the particular ways that the is that uh that has not happened in 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 in, in a long time man okay so all those are warnings and an omen okay all these are signs for things which are about to take place on the planet f okay 2021 man is, is most likely gonna be that very same year that the, the microchip now starts to get introduced now man okay because the way they do it the, the way they're dealing with this uh c9 uh, C, uh c19 virus is the same way that they're gonna deal with the uh, uh with, the, with the with the chip man okay it's the same laws the same process and so on and so forth okay so it says uh, let's read that again it says genesis 1 and 14 it says and the and the power said let there be lights in the firmament of heaven to divide the day from the night this is where we get the moon and the uh, uh, uh the sun and the moon okay so, and let them be for signs and for seasons and for days and for years man so these things are lining up in in, in rare or these rare occurrences are a sign of something about to take place okay that's what they are there for man okay uh for signs and for seasons and for days and for years and let them be for light in the firmament of heaven to give light upon the earth and it was so okay uh acts uh 2 and 16 uh 16 or so acts 2 and 16 and it says but this is what was spoken by the prophet joel and it says and it shall come to pass in the last days so this is the last days okay this is why we're seeing all these things because this is the last days the last days of one kingdom and the beginning of a new kingdom uh uh, uh been ushered in okay he says and it shall come to pass in the last days save the most time i will pour out my spirit upon all flesh and your sons and your daughters shall prophesy and your young men shall see visions and your old men shall dream i uh, shall dream dreams when uh, the brother from one of the brothers from london had the dream of actually being in front of yahweh shaman okay uh, in the presence of the angels Okay, in the presence of Yahweh Shai, okay, bowing to him. Okay, these are all dreams and uh, uh, that uh, 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 our brothers are having, man. Okay, even women are, have, are having particular dreams. Okay, you, you, you see every now and again, you see people on YouTube who, 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 who give testimony of particular visions and dreams that they are having, man. Some of them have seen Yahweh Shai, I mean, like, oh shit, he's actually a black man. Okay verse 18 it says and on my servants and on my handmaids i will pour out pour out in those days what days the last days in those days of my spirit and they shall prophesy at this moment what's the major prophecy that brothers are speaking about uh the mark of the beast okay the destruction the mark of the beast and the destruction because those are two major prophecies that are about to play out on the planet earth and it says and i will show wonders in heaven above and signs in the earth beneath blood and fire and vapor of smoke man so again this again this is another sign man. wonders in the heaven above like this this rare occurrences that are because i know it's, there's gonna be thousands of stargazers that are gonna be out tonight when to get a glimpse or uh, uh of of this occurrence man why because it's a rare occurrence okay 
but they're saying uh you know some parts of the uk might not see it because of the uh because it's the because of the bad weather that uh the uk gets man okay and it says and i will show wonders in heaven above and signs in the earth beneath even the chariots man those are wonders on the in the in the heavens above okay because they can see that there's these particular stars that are moving in a certain you know it's, it's 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 weird man to the world okay it's unexplainable okay and i will show wonders in the heaven above and signs in the earth beneath okay you get uh, what, what you get that uh, things like volcanic uh, volcanic eruptions tsunamis earthquake and so on and so forth okay it says blood and fire and vapor of smoke it says the sun it said the sun shall be turned into darkness and the moon into blood when you get those rare uh, so-called black uh, blood moons okay the last full moon that thing was i remember going to work that day and that thing was just massive man just staring at you okay it says the sun shall be turned into darkness man you've you've got eclipses the beginning of this year man there's all types of signs in the heavens man okay and then the next thing is man the whole world was in lockdown okay it says uh before it said before that great and notable day of the lord come man so those these are all signs before the lord brings the out the, the destruction man okay before the, before the lord so all these things that we are saying now man these are all warnings and omens and tokens for things about to start happening on the planet earth okay and i'm seeing a lot of because what i think I, I i didn't read too much into it but they're saying now uh, uh when this thing happens it says uh the layer uh between the spiritual world and the physical world is very thin at this time of the year man so you know there's gonna be a lot of witchcraft uh, going on today okay but, you know, from the elites a lot of sacrifices and so on and so forth man okay like, I, i've seen i've seen a few videos of jake thinking they're actually gonna get a spiritual power uh uh on this time of the year okay on today man jake thinking they're gonna get spiritual power and so on and so forth man okay why because they're saying there's gonna be a lot of uh movement between the physical world and the and the spiritual world man okay uh let's move on it's uh um this is luke 21 and 10 and said and he says then said he unto them let me see if i read above okay this is luke 21 and 7 and he says and they asked him saying master but when shall this these things be and what sign will there be he said, and what sign will there be when these things shall come to pass so like, let me see uh, okay it's a look 21 and 7 says and they asked him saying master when shall shall these things be and what sign will there be when these things shall come to pass and he said take heed that ye be not deceived for many shall come in my name saying i am the anointed and the time draweth near go ye uh, go ye not therefore after them at this moment uh this scripture i mean the the the, uh, the, the person being highlighted at this moment is general yahana man okay telling people man that Esau is gonna give them the good uh the good maxine and that he needs healthy slaves and so that guy is a hireling okay that guy is literally he is literally leading his his followers straight down the trap man okay verse 9 he said but when he shall hear of wars and commotions and this is this 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 is a prophecy that you hear daily man okay be not terrified for these things must first come to pass but the end is not by and by then said he unto them nation shall rise up against nation and kingdom against kingdom and great earthquakes shall be in diverse places and famines and pestilences man right now the uk might experience a famine why because at this moment because of this new strain of the c uh the c19 virus they are pretty much blocking 
anything that's coming out of the uk okay and even anything that's going into the uk is being blocked because simply they don't want this thing to spread man okay and that can create a famine in itself okay and it says in pestilences uh the, the, the number one of the topic the number one on the topic right now is uh, the c119 itself okay that's a pestilence and it says and fearful sight and great signs shall in great and great signs shall there be from heaven okay again man these are great signs in the heavens okay let's look at that word signs in the new testament okay mm. okay signs in the new testament it says uh it says a sign a mark a token okay that by which a person or a thing it says that by which a person or a thing is distinguished from others and is known okay like right now what is it like what like right now is uh concerning the, the days that we're living in now okay we know that the the, the 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 good days of this kingdom are over okay and the end is being made manifest at the moment okay it says a sign a prodigy a potent i.e an unusual occurrence okay this thing has not been around for hundreds of years man so this is an unusual occurrence or a rare occurrence okay it says uh transcending the common cause of nature okay it says of science pot uh, portending remarkable events soon to happen <laughs> of science portending remarkable events soon to happen the ushering in of the mark of the beast that's something that soon is about is literally is is the door is open already man it's about to enter okay it says uh of science portending remarkable events soon to happen of miracles and wonders by which the most high authenticates the men sent by him or by which men prove that the cause they are pleading is the most high okay so right now is here we are about we uh, particular events are about to take place on the planet f and then there's signs in the heavens to show it okay every time even in history man every time something major was about to happen there was always some great event in the solar system that would happen man okay uh uh, so Luke 21 and 11 it says and 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 great earthquakes shall be in diverse places and famines and pestilences and fearful sights and great signs shall there be from heaven man okay this is what we are at right now man so things and things about major events are about to take place on the planet earth okay uh Uh, Luke 21 and 25 it says and there shall be signs in the sun and in the moon and in the stars again we read what the word uh, stars are uh, signs mean okay let me see okay it says uh look even even the blue letter are there on the description of the of the scripture they write the return of Yahweh shai man okay <laughs> It says Luke 21 and 25. It says, and there shall be signs in the sun. Okay, like we, we saw earlier of the year, we saw uh, some some eclipses. Okay, we've seen our uh, blood moons. Okay, it says, and in the stars. Okay, the stars mean the so they are they are the solar system. Okay, up there in the heaven, man. Okay, when you look when you see these particular planets, they look like stars, man. Okay, big bright lights in the skies okay it says and upon the earth a distress of nations and nations not not distressed right now okay being put into lockdowns okay protesting uh, businesses shutting down and so on and so forth the people in a co are in complete uproar and the news are not even t there is there's so much going on that the news are not even telling you man okay it says and upon the earth distress of nations with perplexity the sea and the waves roaring okay since men's hearts fail in them for fear and for looking after those things that are coming on the earth 
okay right now i mean the worst people people are scared of this uh maxim and because they knew a lot of them they know it's a gov it's a it's a it's a, it's a there's an agenda behind it but they don't want to lose the things that make them comfortable they don't lose their jobs they don't want to lose uh, uh their comfortabilities and so on and so forth man okay but the things are about to get worse man okay it says and then shall it says and then shall they see the son of man coming in a cloud with power and great and great glory man so this this jacob trouble this uh mark of the beast this uh 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 uh, uh maxine and so on and so forth man this these things are about to usher in uh all the things uh uh uh, that are gonna happen just before the return of our lord man okay it says and when these things begin to come it says and when these things begin to come to pass then look up and lift up your heads okay so for us we suppose we're looking up and look lifting up our heads we see seeing chariots okay and and uh, uh our spirits are being lifted up okay it says for your redemption draweth nine man so all these things are a sign for our redemption uh drawing nine okay us being taken away out of this captivity okay so with that man uh, i hope that was uh edifying and until next time our session one